Nurmagomedov is 29. Overeem is 37. He weighed in at 265 pounds. He will have a 10-inch reach advantage. The veteran voice of the Octagon, Bruce Buff. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, the referee in charge, Herb Dean. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the MGM Grand Garden Arena in Las Vegas. Fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a grappler for the professional record of 27 wins, no losses. He stands 5 feet 10 inches tall, weighing in at 155 pounds. Fighting out of the Republic of Pakistan, Russia, Habiba the Eagle, Imagomeda. And now we're going to see his opponent fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist for the professional record of 44 wins, 17 losses, and one no contest. He stands 64 inches tall, weighing in at 265 pounds. Body out of Amsterdam, the Netherlands, Alistair the You've been giving your instruction in the dressing room. Protect yourself at all times. Follow my instructions. We will have a clean fight. Touch gloves, let's make it official. This has been one of the most highly anticipated matchups for a long time. And ladies and gentlemen, strap yourselves in because it's about to go Ready. down right go. now. We are underway. All right, so here is the prolific heavyweight finisher, Alistair Overeem. We'll see how he chooses to attack here in the early going. One of the more accurate strikers in UFC history. It'll be no shocker if he's at his efficient best here in the early going. Nice. Very nice. Joe, your thoughts on what we'll see in this matchup tonight? Alistair Overeem is one of the best strikers in the heavyweight division, and without a doubt, one of his best weapons are his knee strikes. Pay close attention to them in this fight. They could play a huge factor. Staying busy now. A lot of these punches are landing. Got to play better defense than that. Slips. He got tagged there. Romago Medos lowered John now starting to show signs of sweating. Oh, that's a good strike there by Overeem. Yes. Using his jab effectively here, Joe. Oh, how about the multiple strikes landing here? That is a serious offensive barrage. Clip him with the Jets. Both men landing in that exchange. Oh, he got cracked. Slips the shot. Throwing that jab, no good. Nurmagomedov gets caught with that punch. Don't be afraid to get that head off the center line. Oh, slips to avoid the right. And a nice kick. Oh, blocks the shot. He went for an elbow. Well, he eats a punch to the head there, Joe, and he would be wise to get his head off of that center line. It's almost as if he's moving straight into that punch. Well, fortunate that one didn't land to the head. The hook shot blocked by Nurmagomedov. Oh, powerful right leg kick. Oh, pretty good combination of leg kicks there by Overeem. Yes. Joey missed with that straight right attempt. That one hurt. Oh, nice jab by the ring. Oh, good combination. Well, Joe keeping his opponent at distance with that effective jab. Under a minute now to go in round one. Lands the double jab. He blocks the punch. Oh, he blocks the punch. Oh! Overy poured it on! Good kick to the body. He hurt him with that. He is in big trouble here. He's wincing in pain. Oh, oh. solid jab.
aggressive shot just before the end of the round. So now he goes back to the stool, wobbly a little bit. We'll see if the corner can maximize these 60 seconds and keep his head in the fight. And here's a powerful shot that almost ends this fight. And here we see it from another camera angle. Brittany Palmer holding it down for us here. You ready to fight? You ready. Round two here. At the end of that round, his opponent was clearly hurt. Oh! oh! He's in trouble right now. Stiff jab here. That's about as good as it gets with that weapon. Very nice leg kick there by Nurmagomedov. Oh, how clean is that jab by Overeem? Hand speed, man. Continues to mix it up, going to the head, mixing in some body shots. Wow! This could be it right here. Oh, he might be out. here in round two. Definitely picking up the pace after round one. So he got the message from... Oh, he nailed him! He's got him right here. Another shot. He's in trouble. Oh, very nice. Oh, Hit him that hard is a with that hook. hook. We'll see if he can follow it up. He looked like it did stun him a little bit. This could be it. but this last one was the big one that landed for the knockout. Yeah, that was just a gorgeous shot to end the fight right there, Joe. Landed flush, and I'm not even sure the opponent really saw it coming. So back to the drawing board for him, but for the winner, this is certainly exactly what he was looking for here tonight. Check it out here. Bang. So a seminal moment for him here tonight as he gets the huge knockout victory that could hold up as one of the better knockouts of the year. Now we go inside the octagon. Bruce Buffer with the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean is calling stop to this contest at three minutes, 29 seconds of round number two. Declaring the winner by knockout, Alistair. So Alistair Overing just continues to get it done while entertaining the masses along the way. Huge win for the Ream tonight. A guy who statistically is about as accurate a striker as we have on this roster. I thought he was efficient tonight, picked his spots well. Yet another shining moment for one of the best heavyweights to ever do it. Congratulations to Alistair Overing.